Hello and welcome to Unforgettable Love. Today I want to pray for various types of heart conditions. So if you or someone you know or love has issues with their heart, any type of heart problem whatsoever, you may want to share this with them. So I just am wanting to go ahead and jump right in there. So Father, I thank you for this viewer that's watching right now. And I thank you that your word is true and that by Jesus' stripes, they are healed. The same spirit that raised Jesus from the dead is quickening their mortal bodies right now. And I speak to circulatory systems and I command them to line up with that word and become whole and perfect and operate exactly like you're supposed to. Any bad cholesterol levels, to be in the normal, healthy range right now in Jesus' name. Any plaque dissolved, any type of um, blood vessels that are damaged or burst in some way, I command those to be repaired. Any type of blockage, including any type of blood clots, dissolve right now in Jesus' name. I speak to that circulatory system and I command it to be functioning perfectly at optimum health. I speak to the heart muscle itself, and I command any type of congenital defect to be healed right now and to be made as it was designed to be. Or I call brand new hearts in for anyone who needs one. I command holes in the hearts to close up. I command all of the um, arteries and blood vessels and any valves to operate the way it's supposed to and be perfect in Jesus' name. The aorta be perfect in the name of Jesus. The walls of the heart to be the correct thickness in Jesus' name. And I thank you, Lord, that regardless of how the defect came, whether it was a birth defect, whether or not it was some sort of damage due to um, a heart attack, whether it was some sort of congestive heart failure, whether or not it's arrhythmia problems, I just speak to any type of heart condition, whether I've mentioned it or not, and I command it to be healed and whole right now in the name of Jesus. And I speak to other things that occur. Um, I command blood pressure to be perfectly normal in Jesus' name. All the blood levels be perfect. I speak to any edema that has been caused by a heart problem to just completely flush out of their system right now. No more water retention. I speak to breathing issues and for shallow breathing or um, problems with breathing because of, of a heart problem or shortness of breath to cease right now. I speak life to those hearts and those lungs and those uh, blood vessels and all the way down to the capillaries to be healed and perfect in Jesus' name. And I thank you, Lord, that it will be that way and no other right now in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Amen. And I want to thank you for watching. If this blessed you, please like and subscribe to my channel and share it if you believe it will help other people. God bless you, and I love you, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye now. A few years ago, I was invited to a paint and sip type party, and I got the bug, <laughs> and I have created a number of different paintings since then, and I really enjoy doing it. And this year, um, along back around October or so, I was looking online. There's a particular image at Christmas time that really touches my heart, and you've all probably seen it because a lot of artists have done renditions of it, and it's a picture of Santa bowing at the manger of Christ. And some people have asked me, well, don't you think that's kind of bad mixing, you know, the materialistic Santa with Jesus? And to me, I doesn't say that to me. To me, it's the commercial bowing down to the sacred. It is every knee shall bow to Jesus. It's, it's you know, Santa humbling himself, the things of the world. Um, humbling themselves before Christ and receiving him. To me, it is an acknowledgement of Christ in a very special way. And that image has always touched my heart. And as I was Googling images like that online, I ran into a different image. And it was a boy, a young boy, 
praying in a mall with the mall Santa at Santa's chair. And it really touched my heart and I began to look into this and it's based on something that really happened. And um, this image was taken when this little four-year-old Preston had learned about this sick baby in another state and this baby's name is Knox. And he didn't care about getting gifts for Christmas. The only thing he cared about was making sure that Knox was going to live and have a chance at life. And I guess Preston felt like if he could get Santa involved with his prayer chain, that everything was going to be okay. So you see this picture that someone snapped of Preston praying with Santa. And it just really touched me. And so I recreated this image in a painting and I call it Praying with Santa. And I've gotten a lot of wonderful comments about this painting. One person even said it reminded them of a Norman Rockwell type painting. And boy, that meant a lot to me. But um, I went ahead because I felt like this painting is something I needed to share. I had prints made of this from a professional printer and they came out great. And I know it's a square canvas but because of Instagram, square images are very popular now, and it's much easier to find square frames these days. And I have made available to you, if you're interested, Praying with Santa in three different sizes. Right now, you can get an 8 inch by 8 inch size, 6 inches by 6 inch size, or 4 and a quarter inch square also. And I'm going to put a link underneath this video so that you will be able to find that and buy them if you're interested. I didn't have time this year because so many people have expressed interest in this and they want them in Christmas ornaments or Christmas cards. That is something I'm going to be working on this coming year so they'll be available for the Christmas season, but I just didn't have time this year. But if you would like to get a print of Praying with Santa, I would love to send you one. So anyway, I want to thank you for watching. God bless you. I love you. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye now.